it is coming up i don't like to have my phone out too much in this area so quickly quickly it's next to a 99 cent depot and then there's dollar tree and phil one beauty phil beauty wig in here hey fam welcome back welcome back to another video y'all we're about to head into um dollar tree and according to the to the reviews um about this particular dollar tree it's rated as one of the worst dollar trees to go into as far as in northern new jersey um these people they getting high on they fire um in northern new jersey as far as come on y'all as far as the stock as far as the management as far as the way that they treat their customers but i'm gonna go in and find out for myself because that's what i do i like to find out for myself and then that was this year um and then i guess y'all gonna find out what man uh, they accuse people of what um stealing the dollar 25 items yes they do and actually got into fights managers got into fights with customers so in a situation like this if you guys pay attention um to the guy actually not even you know attempting to put any hands on this woman or anything like that but in any situation like this whether it's a dollar tree or walmart having an employee like this working inside of a store is a huge liability um, it seems like the man did not hit back, but we're going to go ahead into this Dollar Tree just to see what it's looking like. And you guys stay all the way through so I can give you my opinion of this particular Dollar Tree. Oh, but just some crazy stuff. I used to come in this area. I used to actually live down the street from this particular Dollar Tree before they opened up. And yeah, whatever. We want to say this for the end. So this is Shauna and I'm officially checking in over here at Moments with us. You guys check in. Let us know where you are watching from and how you are doing. It's Christmas Eve, so let's go ahead and see. Yeah, I had to park inside of a parking lot and walk because every other Dollar Tree that I tried to go to in the area, there was no parks because it's Christmas Eve and everybody doing their last minute things. And I just wanted to get out the house because I ain't been out the house in a few days, so happy we are. And of course, we have Little Miss Maya. Say hello. Hi. Uh, we have Zenobia. Say hello. It is coming up. I don't like to have my phone out too much in this area. So quickly, quickly, it's next to a 99 cent depot. And then there's Dollar Tree. And Phil, one beauty, Phil beauty wig in here. Christmas day will be closed. Watch out, nobody. Christmas day will be closed. Open eight to eight today. So. I don't even know if I need a card. Let's just see what it's looking like. Uh, we're in the store, baby. So let's start from here. Wow, they did change it up a little bit since I last been here. And I was, when I say last been here, I was probably in my 20s, uh, my early 20s at that. So they do still have some Christmas items. Um, say right there, correct me if I'm wrong, I think Dollar Tree also. Do they mark down items that they have left over for the prior season or the prior holiday? And as far as the plus section, I don't know if they have a plus section as of yet. I see that they are about to put up their um their Valentine's Day stuff. Oh, I love the popping popping candy. I love popping candy. Want me to put it away? Yeah. Oh, okay. Come on, let's go. I guess they're gonna go ahead and put some stuff up here. More Christmas items. I wonder what their food area is looking like. You can see everything from right here at this side of the store. Just kitchen items. Boom. Grab it before it's gone. Pantry staple items right there. Boom. Let's see what they have here. Stay right there. Um, cranberry sauce. Chef Bardet. Tomato. Soup. 30% bigger it says. It is definitely wider. A small. I mean, this is small. This is a small thing of mayo. Wow. Zenobi, you can come this way. Then they got Vienna sausages, the chicken ones at $1.25 per this small little pan. Oh, they pulled everything up front, made it easy. Chicken here. Four things of applesauce for $1.25 still isn't bad. They have the small things of the fruit. You only get in three, so remember that three peaches for $1.25. The snack pack for $1.25 as far as their pudding go. Now that's not bad neither. One line. Oh wow, they got the um 
two tarts. This little candy. We used to have something like this when I was younger. Oh. Yeah, we used to have this when I was younger. Yeah, as far as these staples go, macaroni is still coming in under um, $1.25 like at Walmart, though. But they do have it up front here. So that's a great thing to see. So, still, um, when these items were $1. You left the bags in the car? Okay, good. Um, I get these from Dollar General, from the Dollar Owl, but the only thing I don't like, the ones that Dollar General sell, it's a much cheaper, cheaper one. And I notice, like, when we're using it, it instantly breaks. And sometimes it's broken before I even pull it out the box for packaging. So I still wouldn't mind paying $1.25 for this item. Things like gift bags, gift wrap, and stuff like that is not bad for a dollar twenty-five. I definitely come to Dollar Tree to get like gift bags and stuff as well. Oh, okay. oh they got a lot of stock. I found the Scotties. Um, so it is one hundred and twenty-eight in this one here. And then they do have the puffs here. I wonder how many is in here. Ninety-six. Okay. So it depends if you're looking at the count, you know, is it worth that dollar twenty-five? They got 175 sheets in here. I never saw this one in any other one, in any other one for $1.25. That's not bad. And I do see that they have a plus section that we would um be visiting. You want a hula hoop? They broken. Oh, these y'all, you can't get this girl. They broke. They broke, boo. They bent up. All of them. Sorry. As far as their napkins and toilet paper, they do have it. Four rolls, four dollar twenty-five. Still not bad. That thousand sheets for one roll, dollar twenty-five. And they do have a plus section. So as mentioned before, most Dollar Trees do now have a Dollar Tree plus section. Not all, because I'm hearing some from the West Coast. They don't have a some of them in California do not have those plus sections wow when i'm going into dollar trees up north over here i'm seeing these plus sections everywhere not saying that these plus sections have a lot to offer because honestly they don't they honestly they really don't um but at least they do have it this was a big thing for five below now 30 below they have this same setup for their t-shirts for five dollars come on let's go back this way because I don't really see much, and it could be that they are going to pull out their Valentine's Day items. Could be. $3 for their little baking cups. You get $50. Um, but I have not yet to find anything that's really worth buying in the plus sections. And it's only because we have a limited supply of things in these um, Dollar Trees. I used to use these. I think I got some of my stockpile of this brand. $5. I don't think it's bad. I remember it being um, around five and change back then. But I don't know how much they are now. Yes, baby. So their household products, things like their air fresheners, um, cleaners, is definitely worth that $1.25. What is this? Is this new? Because it looks like you can get a lot. It's a multi-purpose cleaning wipes here. Non-toxic industrial strength wipes. Eliminates tough dirt, grime, and grease safe for sensitive skin it don't say anything about an antibacterial though but this is a nice size of something for one dollar and 25 cents i picked up some of these my last um dollar tree visit but i had a mango one i don't like the scent of lavender so i don't mess with lavender but my mother she saw one i'm like i picked that up at dollar tree and she ain't see it but i seen that i tried to tell her but she was into something else but i think she like lavender so i'm gonna go ahead and get her too wait so these are like aromatherapy kind of um fragrant mist this technically is not bad for a dollar 25 they do have the nine lies daily essentials um 12 ounces for dollar 25 and they do have a lot of it not bad annual products is another one if you have small pets at home little bowls 
um, you know, your dishware for your animals. They got something collapsible just in case you want to be on a go. Want to give your dog some water. A, collapse, a collapsible travel bowl. Not bad for $1.25. Shoe toys for dogs. Want to pick up your dog's poop. There you go. This stuff here, all of this stuff here is not bad for $1.25. You get the whole set here for $1.25. Also, items like light bulbs, night lights um you got the plug-in ones still it's some great items that i personally would get from dollar tree you want to get out all right you can get out um also tools you can't go wrong with spending one dollar and 25 cents on tools now one thing i noticed at the last dollar tree that we did go to we talked about things like the arts and crafts sections maybe it's that a lot of people do not visit the arts and crafts section and don't do arts and crafts um in these areas but they stay full over here at least i wonder if they have the big paintbrush over here they tried they got one in a um plus out five dollars for a paintbrush i see now they don't have it over here because now they know they can charge five dollars for it in a in a plus out dental hygiene items for a dollar 25 still maya you don't need makeup put that back girl <laughs> even makeup for a dollar 25 ain't bad at this point um dental hygiene products for a dollar 25 still to this day to me personally is not bad especially for the size of items like a nice size of the mouthwash for one dollar and 25 cents still it's not bad Y'all, when I'm, when I'm trying to get some work done <laughs> with the kids, I'm telling you, especially Maya, because she at that age, she's touching that curious at two and three, even from one. From one to five, they are at their most touchiest and most curious, so they're exploring everything. So I got to constantly stop, you know, just to have her keep up. <laughs> Medication is coming in at $1.25 still is not bad especially with the temperatures have dropped by now melatonin got problems sleeping there you go um yeah especially with the temperatures dropping everywhere definitely um for dollar 25 still not bad you can actually find some of these medications still in the dollar out at dollar general so look out for that first eight items if you don't have your first aid kit um you know up to gear definitely you could come here pack up your first aid kit make sure you got everything you need band-aids alcohol pads um certain creams antibacterial creams like, like the triple antibiotic um cream not bad come on mommy she's got a mirror a bow come this way um feminine hygiene items still not bad for a dollar 25 oh wow when did they start selling the pedia shore in here Wow, I never seen this in there. They even got the PD power light. It's an electrolyte solution. Like if your child or anyone have like a fever, um, diarrhea, vomiting, stay right there. Di diarrhea, vomiting. Um, definitely, you got to work on keeping their electrolytes up. So having anything that have electrolytes is a great benefit to have, you know, your stockpile. Just to have in your home, especially dealing with um, small children, elderly, even yourself, because. If you ain't good, ain't nobody good. But baby items too, it's a great. You know, for a dollar twenty-five, can't beat it. Listen over here, where you going, girl? I'm here. Care products. I hear okay things about the Dermacil in general. This is new as well. I never saw this detangler. It's a cotton candy scented detangle spray for ages three and up. It says. Not that I would use it for my kids, but. I do notice they have it. And as far as hair dyes for $1.25, come on, y'all. Y'all know y'all can't beat this. Maya, even spray bottles, perfect. And as far as their plus section, honestly, all of the Dollar Trees have the same items for their plus sections um, when it comes down to their food items. So here's what it says. We'll get a picture. All right. Oh, wow. They even have. Oh, that's a baby. I thought that was like a tongue scrubber for babies. Well, they have these. I remember I had bought a, lunch, a bunch off of um, Amazon and I could have just got it from here. This is great. Let me just get one more. 
Oh wow, they have a tropical scented moisturizing body wash. I wonder how this smell. Oh, that don't look like it's good. If that's a lip balm that says Cheetos, the bath balm, and it smells like Cheetos, that's not good. This actually smells good. Mm. She ain't even smelling Chantal yeah. something. Mm. Bath dust. These are some great little finds for $1.25 if you're into all of this stuff. Crystal Waters Coconut Scented. Ooh. People definitely come here, especially like senior citizens. Um, coming here to get their basic stock ups i heard about a water oh my god i wish i can go back to the um thing it was a certain water that people was talking about yeah it was a certain water that people was talking about you're not she angry no that looked nasty i would not try no snickers iced coffee um for a dollar 25 and it ain't bad as far as the water go i think it was the eternal water i think i heard good things about this I'm gonna go off on my think because it's the naturally alkaline spring water. Let's try it. I already got this one. I don't even know if this one was it, but I honestly I think it's this eternal water that I heard them speaking about. But I'm gonna feel. Yeah. And the amount of ounces you can get as far as juice go for $1.25, it's not bad because this is already a half a gallon and it's only $1.25. So juices is definitely a great thing to pick up. Now for a dollar twenty-five, you can get a six-pack, um, a six-pack of the sixteen-point-nine-ounce standard-size water bottles for a dollar twenty-five. Now, still, that's not bad, actually. So things like your basic um, snacks, crackers, things for the kids, maybe something you just want to get real quick. Dollar twenty-five. This is a pack of three. Not bad. What do you want? Cheese crackers? I don't think you're gonna eat this one. This cream cheese. But we got a whole thing of this on the fridge already, so you're good to go. You don't like that one? I like it. I got a whole little thing of these shortbread cookies here for a dollar twenty-five. Wanabana. Remember, guys. I think Wanabana is. Um, I don't know which one, but they definitely had a recall on this brand as far as with the lead. Here you go. Cinnamon. It was the cinnamon one that had that recall um, due to intentionally putting a certain amount of lead in these items. This aisle is definitely packed. Come over here. So they do have some loaves of bread here. I mean, it might not be the largest loaf, but they do have it available. Um, 118. How can that last till 118? I don't know. But as far as like them pantry staple items, it's, it's not really a lot. Even with your shelf stable milk, they don't have much here. And my issue is with people, if they're not stockpiling out and they're looking for affordable places to get items now, once these things phase out, if it does come back, I'm I'm worried that it'll come back at a higher price and a lot of people won't be able to afford it. Oh, well, that's open. And I've been seeing this blow up all over the place. I don't know what some pink sauce is. It say as seen on TikTok and Instagram. And then the small pack of like the Sasson. I might as well just get the big large pack of $4 and change at BJ's like I do. Um, but things like pickles, sauces, a dollar twenty-five, still not bad at all. All of these items not bad. And instead of spending that three dollars and change, you can get the Mick Trader for a dollar twenty-five. So, yeah, let's actually head up out of here. This is small horseradish ugh, sauce. All of this stuff, strawberry vanilla jam. What's in this? Is it just that? No ingredient: strawberry, citric, natural vanilla, flavor, potassium. Mm-hmm. There you go. And as far as their cleaning products, though, they do have some available. Um, they do have a lot more cleaning products available than most Dollar Trees that I've been into. They got this powder bleach color safe here. And then, of course, also, they have my sponges. Um, I do get them from Dollar Tree. I saw your comment 
someone said you can get the same thing in Dollar Tree. It's in the sponge, um, the dish section with the sponges and stuff at. But the only difference with Dollar Tree, though that, not Dollar Tree, Dollar General, though that they are a dollar, you only get five versus this six pack for $1.25. And they do too. Here, have a lot. And they have a lot. They got the sticks here. They ain't have them at the other one. So they got the sticks here. You can put them on a mop. You can put them on a plunger. You can put them on a broom. You can do a lot with them. Still great items to get, like little dishware items. Um, my favorite items to get from Dollar Tree, of course, will always be this section of items. So don't be able to cart. And then this is cute. This is really cute. For a dollar. This is cute. This looks really nice for that price. Just one more cup. I tell myself that all the time. And I end up on three. These bowls are really nice. Live simply. Oh, and it's nice and tall too. Like all of this stuff is still well worth. I mean, they can put this in like the five, the plus section is you can spend like three dollars on that. And to me personally, I probably still spend three dollars on it because they are cute these type of items that you leave on your stove put the little spoons in there when you're cooking don't do that mama i just see it. let me have that thank you um yeah these are great for a dollar 25 still can't beat it I like cookware dishware and stuff like that you still cannot beat these items they say these are a dollar so the flatware is a dollar and we got to check the prices of the glasses no I see they moved some stuff all the way up there to the front, but I kind of can't get over there. Um, yeah, so all reading glasses and all Dollar Trees look like, and sunglasses, did go up to $1.50. About to be. So even things like ramen, I saw this go up to like $3 and change when, you know, certain stores be price, price gouging. This isn't bad. I never saw this pack. I guess it's the same, but the packaging change, I guess. Oh, no. Different brand. McTrader. Uh, chicken flavored noodles easy to make rice you know what stuff's making that easy to make rice microwavable rice mm -hmm. typically 90 seconds you heat that up and things in a can most definitely you can't beat it um but a dollar 25 you can still get canned vegetables at walmart for under one dollar for now so another item that did go up in price in Dollar Tree is now a dollar fifty is the balloons. So the helium filled balloons are now a dollar fifty. So now I should have picked up that calamine lotion because I was looking for it in Dollar Tree and they didn't have and they usually have a whole bunch of calamine lotion in Dollar Tree. So maybe they just don't sell it anymore. I don't know. So the next time y'all go to y'all Dollar Tree, let me know if y'all see some calamine lotion because I wonder if that item is no longer being sold for a dollar twenty five. Um, and as far as what I got from Dollar Tree, I like $25. So some items did go up in Dollar Tree, y'all. Did go up. I did spend, oh, this is Family Dollar. I only spent a dollar and three cents. Um, Dollar Tree, I did spend $25.66. One thing when you are buying items, even for $1.25, you got to think about your taxes as well. So how much is taxes? general exempt merchandise for certain things it says 66 cents was our my taxes today um so i did get that stick they get another one here only thing is they kind of break after a while but you can use them for a lot of things and then i did also get some waters here so i know some of y'all probably gonna look at this water like oh i tried that it was nasty but i never tried this so we have this water and then we have three of these eternal waters because i heard some things about it somebody said it tastes really good i just don't know where it came from so i have three of those and then i have one of these i wish they had blood put everything back because i'm in a car kind of want to not lay everything out and then we have some items here. I didn't pick up too many sponges because if y'all came with me to Dollar Tree last time, we picked up a whole bucket full. So I have two more of these. Two of these. I'll let y'all know how these work out. They're just basic wipes, y'all. Multi-purpose cleaning wipes. It don't say anything about a disinfectant, though. Lemon scented. Non-toxic, it says. 
and leave no sticky residue on skin. Da -da -da -da. Yeah, it's not a disinfectant, so if you're looking for a disinfectant, this ain't it. This is just a wipe. A regular old wipe. It only got... No, it doesn't. Mm -mm. So I have two of these. And this stuff come up to $25. It don't even seem like much. One broom, one actual broom thing. I'm gonna have Kia on some toothbrushes, some more glue. Because whatever I open, I like to re um to restock. So I, I did open up one of these, so I'm gonna put that back in the stockpile. I did open up one of these, so I want to put one back in the stockpile while it's a dollar twenty-five, y'all. Little ice pack there. And then another little finger toothbrush for Kian. And then I did pick this up even though Maya said, no, don't get that. And then Maya threw this little Minnie Mouse rag in the cart. And then kids going to have this thing, this little candy. It's a Slurpers sour what? candy. You like it. You don't even like sour stuff. Like and that's, sour. that's it for $25.66. It ain't take us too far. No. Oh, no. And then the spray. Where's my spray? The spray is in the bag with the water. I'm going to leave that in the car because I want to give that to my mother. I know. It's just a, a aromatherapy. So I got these for my mother, which I'm going to leave in the car. No, it's not a Christmas gift, girl. Can you go with you? I still have to laugh. Can you go with you? So that was it for $25. Can you go with you? It don't look like much, but this is as far as $25 took me you? today. I'm not going anywhere. I'm going to give it to her when I see her. So if you all enjoyed today's video, um, please go ahead and subscribe. If you're new here, of course, thank you for coming along. If you've been here before, thank you so much for always coming back. You guys, the channel been doing amazing, so I want to thank you all for also putting in your hard work by coming through, pressing the like button, new people subscribing, share. I see y'all been sharing, so thank you so much for that as well. Um, so yeah, we just came from Dollar Tree, and hopefully y'all enjoyed that little walkthrough. And if you did, thank you. Um, I had something to say, but we're going to leave that right there where it's at because it is Christmas Eve, and I'm about to go in the house. Um, you all stay prepped, stay blessed, stay safe. Most of all, remain beautiful queens and kings. Until next time, y'all, I'm officially up out of here. God bless you all. Love you all. And peace.